A South Memphis shooting inside a rooming house left one man fighting for his life as the gunman went on the run. When police arrived at the home, they detained a woman and a man who were roommates to both the victim and gunman. WREG's Jarita Patterson has more on what happened. Just before 10 p.m. Valentine's Day, there was no love lost when two housemates at this rooming house started arguing. It was so scary. One woman whose face we are not showing also lives in the Airways Boulevard house. She explained to us the day before the two men whose rooms are just feet apart. We saw for ourselves they were feuding over a missing gun. The next day, her 67 year old housemate, she says, was approached by her 40 year old housemate who was armed. The 40 year old is said to have called his baby brother over for backup. The two brothers allegedly began beating the 67 year old. Seconds later, the victim was shot in the stomach. Police were first on the scene, detaining the woman we spoke with and her son. He started crushing me. What well, went down? He, and then you say, he said, Did you see any shooting? I say yes, sir. That terrifying moment left her and others inside the home ducking for cover in order to get out of harm's way. But something she could not avoid, she tells us, was seeing the aftermath as her housemate of many years was lying close by, struggling to survive. The victim was still in, in the house. When they came and uh, the paramedic came in the house to get him off the floor car. He, he lost so much blood. After the shooting and before police arrived, it's alleged the man who shot his roommate ran outside the home, stopping here before dashing across the street to fire two more rounds. From there, he ran away under the cover of darkness. Well, it's over with. Yeah. We couldn't go in the house. We had to sit outside. Oh, I'm so sorry. In South Memphis, Jarita Patterson, WREG News Channel 3. Well, the victim who was originally listed in critical condition has since improved. If you have any information that could help detectives find the shooter, call Crime Stoppers at 528-CASH.